Now, some of you are affected. You appreciate what I'm trying to do. But supposing you are not affected, what do you do? You just stand by and say bad luck to those affected. And I ask you don't. If today somebody else is affected, they are also our fellow human beings, our neighbors. We must come out and help them. Because next time when we are affected, they will come and help us. This is called social justice. Social justice cannot be, I only take care of myself. Only when I'm affected, then I come out. That, that also, that's not social justice. Social justice requires us to come and say, this is not fair. Although I'm not affected, I must be willing to speak. Now, actually, I don't want to stand in any election, either as president or as member of parliament. I'm 60 years old. My wife says, what for I go and get into trouble? And many people say, Mr. Tan, you must be careful. You see what happened to Jayaranam, you have to see what happened to this, what happened to that. It will happen to you. So therefore, for me, do I want to have this kind of trouble? I'm quite well off. I don't need to have this kind of trouble. But I say, do we want Singapore to carry on like this? Now, Mr. Leong Sihian tells you how many people cannot afford to pay their HDB flat. Let me tell you why these people can't afford. Many of them lost their jobs. They cannot find another job, so they can't afford to pay. Today you have your job. Tomorrow you lose your job. You will be like one of them. Now, I am going to put my speech in the online citizen. What must we do? Mr. Ravi Menon says, a living wage. That means a salary a person earns must be enough at least to pay for housing and food and to live a humble life. But if not even enough, how many people have to do two jobs? Have to work 16 hours just to survive? Is this the kind of social justice? So I ask you, please read and understand why I am willing to come out. Hopefully, it's not for me, I'm 60 years old. But I want to encourage other people to come up. And other people, they are not so ready to come up. You see, I can reach because financially I am quite well off. But other people are not so well off, they cannot take that kind of risk. But if I have got 100,000 signatures, other people will be willing to come up. Because they know there is enough support to make some change. So therefore I ask you to sign not for me, but for other people to come forward. There is extra form here. One signature you put in, very hard to collect 100,000. So please collect one form, go back and collect 20 signatures. Every one of you take one sheet. If you want to collect 100 signatures, how many forms must you take? Five forms. Because I cannot get 100,000. Now some people say, Mr. Tan, you don't need 100,000. You can just come forward. That's true. I can come forward. But one person alone is not enough. Therefore, I need to encourage more people to come forward. So the 100,000 signature is to encourage other people to come forward. So please do your best to help. Now, I say it's important to have social justice. The second thing that is very important is to have members of parliament that represent you. When you have problem, you must see your MP and you must feel that the MP listen to you, understand your problem, 
help as best as they can. Some people see the MP and come back and tell me, Mr. Tan, my MP not so interested to help. Then what is the point of letting this person be your MP? Make the MP someone that's willing to act for you. So these are my two points. First, uh, we want a society to be more socially fair. And we must help people who lose their jobs. Not their fault. The company cannot survive, go away. Now, when you lose your job, let me tell you, to find another job in Singapore is very difficult. So you therefore need to have much more better health. Yes, the government has got workfare, but workfare is $100 supplement to your income. It's not enough. Do you know how many people just now uh, uh, somebody said $600 a month is part-time worker. I know many people working full-time that earn $600 a month. And for them to earn enough, they have to do two jobs. Is this the kind of society we want? Because HDB flag is not like 30 years ago, quite affordable. HDB flag is very expensive. Cost of living, very expensive. We must have, in other countries, they call a minimum wage. Mr. Ravi Menon says a living wage. We must fight for that. Otherwise, why should people work so hard and can't even feed a family? We must also have members of parliament that understand the people, the hardship of the people.